Uh, my name is Mike Fox. My story is I was born into a Catholic family and went to Catholic school. And after eighth grade, we did two more years of uh, education to be confirmed. And on the last day of that, I got into a little argument or dispute with the priests and we determined I should return when I was going to take it more seriously. So fast forward 27 years, I took a break from church. My view of Christians were these extremist people that were not inclusive. Um, my view was that they viewed themselves better than the rest of society. Uh, kind of like a, a fraternity or a group or a cult. And so my wife started going to different churches and I encouraged her and she wanted me to come and I wasn't having it. Um, she ended up landing at Victory, so I was like, oh, of course you found one of those weird churches where they put their hands up in the air and sing modern songs. So I wasn't too excited about it and she put a lot of pressure on me and I finally said, yeah, I'll go. I'll go next Sunday with you. And so that Sunday morning arrives. She wakes me up and said, let's go. And I said, oh, so I'm super hungover from the night before. And I said, no, no, I'll, maybe next week. She said, you told me you'd go. So off I went. I thought, ah, I can power through an hour, hour and a half of this nonsense. And while I was there, uh, incredible feeling inside of me. Uh, emotions poured out. So that next Monday, or the Monday or Tuesday after there, I went and saw Pastor Mike and I was telling him about this feeling and he nonchalantly, well, that's the Holy Spirit. Here's what we believe in. And so I don't know if he intentionally did that or not, but I wanted more, you know, I wanted to know what this Holy Spirit feeling was inside of me. And I've been uh, learning that and experiencing it ever since. Victories affected me in a very positive way. Uh, I am a new person now. Uh, every decision I make now, I, I attempt to bounce off of scripture. Um, I don't want to do anything that's not going to glorify God. Anymore. So, whether that's <clears throat> family, business, day-to-day -day activities, so it's transform my life quite positively, which I think is having a positive ripple effect on the world. Uh, the healing I would say I've experienced is predominantly emotional healing. Uh, I bottled up or pushed aside emotions quite well for the time I was not a church member. So it's really opened me up emotionally, which I think is quite beneficial to the family, which in turn honors God and glorifies God. So the healing I've experienced most would be emotional. Healing's, it's out there and it's a gift that's readily given. Um, I think a lot of people look in the wrong place for healing. Uh, I think Victory as a corporate church has an amazing talent for dishing out healing. Um, I would just, uh, my advice would be to just come and ask, and it'll be given. Uh, why should somebody consider checking out Victory? The music's fantastic. Uh, every week, the message that's giving somehow resonates, I think, well, for me anyways, it always resonates, and I think, oh, is this thing directed at me? And it's probably the most welcoming place I ever walked into. I, uh, the first time I was there, I had a feeling of not worthy, and I was immediately embraced by the church. So I consider Victory my new family. I still have my family and love them, and never been rejected by them per se, but uh, it's one of the most embracing places I've ever been. Welcoming. <laughs>